my original video got copyright strike and well they strike my channel and remove the video so in this video I'll use footage of gameplay and if you have already seen the video maybe watch it again and that would be helpful for me anyway getting into the video it's been more than a week that flash is released so this is final that flash bombed at the box office so there might be hundred different reasons for this movie's failure but I think these are the biggest nail in the coffin and in this video we'll discuss about that so let's get into the video the first and the most most common thing many people are complaining about is Ezra Miller. This person had done a lot of weird ass stuff. So he is a criminal now. And then WB being WB, they just fucked their own movie by not associating with the main actor of their movie, the title character of the movie, The Flash. So Ezra Miller was kinda sidelined for Michael Keaton to show up. Now they could have made this movie named Batman The Flashpoint or something, cause Batman was barely in the movie. Ben Affleck was 10 or something minutes and Michael Keaton was, spoiler alert, he dies, he is defeated by Zod. And then we do have George Clooney as Batman, so that's not enough to sell the movie as a Batman movie. But well, the trailers promise it to be a Batman movie and the title of the movie promises it to be a Flash movie. There is already a disconnect between the studio and the movie makers. And then came one of the biggest reasons, James Gunn. James Gunn got to be the new head of DC movies and well he announced his own DC universe on January or February of this year while they had a whole year of movie releases planned and these upcoming movies they would not be the part of James Gunn's DC so this killed any and every hype about DC movies going forward so if you are watching this video so far why not subscribe to my channel cuz we just crossed 500 subscribers and the race is on baby so we are going to get thousand hopefully soon enough so Subscribe. Moving on to the third big reason. This movie had a lot of pre-screening. A little too much to be very honest. Every week for the last few months I've been hearing reviews about the Flash movie and the movie is not yet released. So everyone saying different stuff. Someone was like overly positive while others are like overly negative. Then a week before the movie releases, big names of Hollywood started calling this movie a masterpiece. And that was the shittiest thing they might have done cause that didn't attract the fan but made them skeptical cause I heard that Tom Cruise was like this is the best movie. Marvel maybe not great at this moment but to be the best movie a best superhero movie. This movie has to be better than Infinity War, Endgame, Spider-Man No Way Home, Civil War, Winter Soldier. Those movies are amazing. So this movie being the best that was like over promising for a crappy movie and audiences are anything but fool. So everyone saw through it. The next big reason is cameos done wrong. This movie have Nick Cage as Superman, Christopher Reeves as a CGI version of Superman but they don't have Henry Cavill as Superman or the Flash from CW or Christian Bale as Batman. Even if you have not watched the CW show, you definitely seen him in the Flash costume. So having him not show up made the fans of that show feel underwhelmed. From my video, you might think that I'm complaining about one cameo and undermining all the others, but think about a situation where Toby and Andrew didn't show up as Spider-Man, but Jake Gyllenhaal shows as Spider-Man. That wouldn't made us connect with No Way Home, cause Andrew and Toby were the Spider-Man for most people. So that's a cameo done right. And yes, I know many people are saying about the fact like the CG is bad, the story is bad, there is some goofy stuff. Well, those are like superficial reasons, but the story overall was pretty okay. And at this point, that is pretty normal cause Black Adam with its simplistic story worked at least better than this movie. So this movie could have worked. So that's it for today's video and hope you enjoyed my video and if you did, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and share this with your friends, families, anyone you want to share it with and hope to meet you in the future.